Greetings everyone and welcome to Utique Bridal. This will be part of Sewing My Back to Work wardrobe series. In this video, you will get a glimpse of how I sew the darts on my classic sheath dress, as well as how I'm going to style it when complete. But before I begin, I would like to thank So Much Fabric for being our sponsor. And thank you Andrea over at sew to fit for tissue fitting me, as well as for cutting my fashion fabric. If you would like to view the fitting process, I will put the link in the description box below. So now all I have to do is sew the beautiful gray ponty knit fabric together. I'll start with sewing the darts. To preserve the fabric, I am going to use the tailor's tack method to sew the darts. So here's a quick glimpse of the process. And when I'm done sewing the darts, I'm just going to sew the front and back pieces together, as well as the hem, and I am complete with the classic sheath dress. And now we can start accessorizing and styling the outfits. The first look is going to be the casual look. I also call this my mommy mode look. This is when I'm running errands with my children or when I'm up at their school volunteering. Yes, I know, I still have my hair bun, but I'm trying to transition out of it. But it's just so quick and easy that I just tie it up and then wear my headband. Then quickly fill in my eyebrows and put on my eyeliner and mascara and I'm out the door. I normally don't wear a lot of makeup, so this is my quick and casual look. I do have to go into an office and attend meetings, so I'll take the dress to another level. Because the office gets cold, I'm just going to put on my white shirt that I sewed, then dress it up with a double-sided ribbon that I'm going to tie into a bow. Now let me put my glasses on and let's get down to business. Now let's take this day look and then bring it into the evening. I do enjoy dinner dates with my husband or just catching up with friends over dinner. So I do love to accessorize and put on a darker shade of lipstick. Because I like a quick and easy hairstyle, I tend to tie it back for that modern, sleek look. This must be a very special year because there's so many people falling in love and getting married. I will be a guest to at least four weddings this year. So congratulations to my cousin Tran and Robert and to the young adults at my church who are tying the knot. So as a wedding guest, I'm going to dress up the sheath dress with some sparkly jewelry. And in case there's a cold breeze in the reception hall, I'm going to throw on something light like a shawl or my cape jacket to keep me warm. Let's give a toast to the newlyweds. Because this is a wedding channel, I ask myself, now what if I was an unconventional bride? I would put on my black satin gloves and my bandeau veil. Now let's get married and live happily ever after. So which one was your favorite look? Or how would you style your classic sheath dress? Let me know in the comments section below. The possibilities are endless. Well, thank you for visiting, and I hope you get inspired to create something extraordinary out of the ordinary. If you would like to watch the In The Zone white shirt video, please click on the top image. If you would like to learn how to prepare a hair comb, please click on the bottom image. If you would like to learn how to make the bandeau veil, please click on my veil.